I couldn't be happier than to be here tonight to celebrate my friend Ginger Farley. Uh-oh, I'm getting a little emotional. You're getting this award tonight for service to the field. And I have witnessed how seriously you take that through our private conversations to watching you speak as the executive director of the Chicago Dance Makers Forum and just your passion and your extreme dedication to this art form is, it's palpable. I don't know many people with Ginger's depth of knowledge about the way things get done. I feel like she's always ready to dive right into the mechanics and the alchemy of dance making, of course, but also fundraising, public programming, positioning, communication, partnership. She's helped a lot of people do a lot of stuff and she keeps a lot of stuff in her head about what people need and when they need it by. And I feel like Ginger connects those providers and recipients as often as humanly possible. To watch you work with the dancers like one-on-one -on -one and, to, and to just listen to some of the very technical um, uh, tips and, and information that you were giving them, it made me realize, wow, there's still like just so much kind of movement and desire in your body. And I just loved seeing that and hearing that. More and more truth is corrupted with alternative facts, yet my friendship with Ginger provides me with a space where truthful reflection is safe. Because of this, I am a better human being, a better teacher, a better artist, a better leader, a better family member, a better colleague and friend. And I believe that we are all better in some way because of Ginger's reflective love and service to our field. Ginger has made so much time for so many people to experience their work, to be in community with them, to listen, to make yourself that available is such a gift to the people around you. Thanks for the joy you've brought us through your love of dance and your support of our community. I love you, my dear friend, and there is absolutely nothing you can do about it.